guys good evening how are you okay uh so so i already see one of them have joined in now we'll just wait uh guys uh hi shivendra hi shubhangi hi dia yeah yeah it's going to happen listen uh please make a note of the uh, code uh download menti quiz put on these uh, uh, this uh, number and you will be able to join me for the quiz guys are you ready guys uh, so uh, i am just sharing the code with you please download the menti uh, app menti meter and the code you have to use is 501830 Guys, please give me an answer whether you are able to hear me. Yes, today we have Menti Jagriti. Hi, Kainat. Jolly. Hi, Saraswati. Sirat Kaur. Please join in with the code five zero one eight three zero. Join in quickly, guys. I'll wait for you to. Five zero one eight three zero. So I have guys joining in. Hi, bye, Ma Chaudhary. Please join in for the menti quiz. The code is five zero one eight three zero. Hi Kanika, good evening. Hi Akshay Hara, good evening. Please join in with the code five zero one eight three zero quickly. Hi Parikshit. Join in with the code. Please download Mentimeter and join in with the code five zero one eight three zero. Hi, Abhinav. Mahima, please download the Mentimeter and join in with the code five zero one eight three zero. Join in, guys. Hi, Jonty, where were you? I didn't see you for some time. So quickly, go join in, guys. Once all of you are in, then we can start the quiz. Join in, guys, quickly. Download Mentimeter. Join in with the code five zero one eight three zero. Ah, uh, okay. Ah. Uh, Guys who have already joined in, please help out the other students to join in. Mahima, Jolly, Shivendra, if you have already joined in, please guide the other students how to join in. Dia, please help the students. Tell them how to join in, Dia. Very good. Please help the other students to join in, please. Once all of you have joined in, we will start. I will start in another two minutes, Jagrati. Tera kadam. Ah, uh, it will be a good experience for you, Tara. See, Momita is giving you instructions. 
instructions how to join in. Please follow her instructions. Lakshya, please download Mentimeter app from Play Store and enter the code 501830. Join in another two minutes. We are going to start. So I see a whole lot of students joining. 21 students, 20 students as of now. Join in guys quickly. Did all of you get it? Tara, Prithvi, Lakshya. Great going guys. Another one minute and I am going to start. We have 20 participants as of now. Quickly join in. I know I see some lovely images here. <laughs> I see some cakes, donuts, flowers, strawberry and fox. Number 8. Super. I see so many interesting characters on my screen. Super. So we have 23 participants as of now. Saraswati join in. Part 3. Okay sorry part 3. Akshay. Please download Mentimeter from Play Store and the code is 501830. Super guys, can we get started? All of you, hi, uh, hi Vibor, have you joined? Chaitanya, join, very good, Part V. Part V, did you join? Akshay, your strawberry, super. Seema Kumari, join in quickly. Super, we have 27 participants. Amazing. Join in guys, quickly, quickly. Shall we get started now? Okay, I am starting the quiz. All the best guys, all the best. Keep your eyes on the leaderboard. Okay, here comes the question. Showy but of little value. You have to give me the answer now. Please choose. Guys, you have 60 seconds. Showy but of little value. What does it mean? Luxurious, decorative, extrovert or trumpery? Okay, rabbit, all of you fox. Okay, shoot. Super guys, you have 33 seconds to go. Quickly, answer. Quickly join in guys. We have 18 participants. What happened to the others? Yes. So as soon as the... Four, three, two, one. Give me the answer, guys. Woo! So, so guys, trumpery is the right answer. Trumpery is the right answer. Awesome. So, guys, what does showy but of little value means? That is, a particular thing only looks good. But it doesn't have any value. It is an eye wash. So that is trumpery, isn't it? Very good, Parikshit. Are you answering? Yes, guys. Super. Did all of you follow what it means, guys? Here. Okay. Shall we go to the leaderboard? Here comes the leaderboard. Yeah. Awesome. Amazing. So we have uh, Aaron, Sam, Anchal, then Vibhor, Shukrita, Mamita, Day, Smita, Suchita, Tripathi, Shiva, Singh, 
Mahima Chaudhary, Parikshit Yadav. Amazing. So all of you have done great. We have 24 participants and you two are, you all are in the top eight. Amazing guys. Can we move on to the next one guys? Please join in, join in as much as possible. Super. I'm moving on to the next, next one. Here comes your question. Having a quarrelsome character. Having a quarrelsome character. Haughty, opponent, belligerent, salubrious. The spelling, there is a mistake here. There is a mistake of salubrious, guys. S-A-L-U-B-R-I-O-U-S it is. Salubrious, there is a mistake. So, never mind. So, you have... 34 seconds to go. Please choose your answer correctly. Haughty, opponent, belligerent, salubrious. There is a spelling mistake. I'm sorry for that. Typo error. S-A-L-U-B-R-I-U-S. Good evening, Chandan. Please join in. We have 26 participants. Guys, please. Just about 6, 5, Four, three, two, one. That's it. Let's see how many of you have answered. Super, guys. So your answer is belligerent. How many of you answered? Belligerent is the answer. Super. So, guys, having a quarrelsome character, that means a person who is always ready to fight. Isn't it? It means aggressive. Belligerent means aggressive. Who is always ready to fight at the drop of a hat? Isn't it? So C is the right answer. Very good. Rohit Sahu, Shubhangi Kishore, Arun Mishra. Let's go to the leaderboard. Let's go to the leaderboard. Guys, our team members have shared the code, number, code with you. So those who have not joined, please join the uh, quiz. We have 30 participants now. Super, I'm going to see the le leaderboard. Oh, oh, amazing. It's Aaron, Sam, Anchal, Vibhor, uh, Shukrita, then Mom. Oh my God. Then Momita De, Suchita Tripathi, Shiva Singh, Mahima Chaudhary. Oh my God. Look at this. Amazing, amazing. Can you see the leaderboard, guys? Super, super. Excellent. Okay. Let me move on to the next, next one. Okay, get ready for the next one. Long lasting deep bitterness. Long lasting deep bitterness. See the options on your screen. Rancor, grouse, empathy, enormity. Guys, you have 46 seconds to go. Please choose Kishan Gupta, go to Play Store, download Mentimeter and the uh, code is shared in the description box. Please check. 501830. Yes, Shubhangi, at times because of a delay, because of lag, you may not see your name reflecting here. So guys, you have just... 17 seconds to go. Please answer correctly. Maybe due to Rami, quickly join in the join in for the quiz. Two, one, here goes. Answer. Yay! So we have Ranker is your answer. Amazing. Who's got it right? We will see the leaderboard in a minute. Guys, what is long-lasting deep bitterness? A person who, you know, keeps grudges, <clears throat> keeps grudges, something which has happened in the past, which he continues to keep in his heart till the present. That is called what? Rancor. Rancor is the word. What is grouse, guys? Grouse is a name of a bird, a name of a game bird. Empathy is showing compassion. 
enormity means showing the um, you know the um, extremity of a situation so that is enormity right so your answer is rancor harsh dube hi ma'am facing some network issue here oh vibhor try and join in here i don't want you to leave see if you are able to just log out and log in again vibhor check yes fine can we see the leaderboard now amazing see the leaderboard guys so we have momita de suchita tripathi shiva singh mahima choudhary kainat shukrita varun smita oh now see the entire thing has changed guys you know you people are doing an amazing work uh, depending upon your uh, quickness in answering see the entire thing has changed so we have mahima choudhary kainat momita de varun blueberry shukrita jagriti smita suchita tripathi shiva singh amazing guys are you guys enjoying are you having a good time guys yes hi jinesh please join in go to play store download mentimeter apply the code 501830 and you will be able to join in those who have not joined in amazing guys i'm moving on to the next question okay now we come to an idiom spin a yarn what would it mean look at the options carefully convince him to tell a long story ask permission make somebody agree Yes guys you have 43 seconds to go please think and answer join in guys join in as much as possible you will have fun super super yeah guys we have 21 seconds to go those who are unable to join in please answer in the uh, chat box so that i can keep a um track on it shubhangi says 2 gorav says 2 2 1 there you go your time's up let's see the uh, wow we have 19 who have answered correctly that is to tell a long story right amazing so i have got some answers here also dia have you joined in dia jain have you joined in amazing amazing you people have joined in we have 37 of them who are playing the menti quiz here amazing guys okay so guys a uh, convince spinner yarn if you say i can give you a sentence of spinner yarn so i can say she always manages to spin a yarn and convince her boss she always manages to spin a yarn and convince her boss right it's a nice uh, uh, this thing isn't it a nice uh, sentence so i'm going to give you a sentence for these uh, idioms or phrases which has been given to you right we will go to the leaderboard amazing just wait Woo, we've got the leaderboard here just let me see we will just shuffle this up a little bit and woo we have the answers so we have varun jagrati varun is the fastest here jagrati suchita tripathi shiva singh kainat mahima choudhary parikshit yadav anchal aram sam and momita de amazing guys amazing having fun are you enjoying this okay can we go on to the next question we are moving on to the next question guys here comes your question turned turtle what do you mean by turned turtle your 
Countdown has started. You have 52 seconds to go. Amazing. Gaurav, please join in. Uh, download the Mentimeter uh, from your Play Store. And I. Uh, the code is 501830. Gaurav, turn turtle. You have 30 seconds to go. Guys, if you are having fun, please like and share immediately. Guys, you are having fun, please like and share this video immediately. We can come on with more sessions like this. Hey, I hope you are not uh, googling it. I hope you are not seeing. Yes, all of you. Fine, here comes the answer. Woo! 20 of you have answered it correctly. Yes. So, what's the answer? Guys, 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 no. The answer here, I think there is a mistake here. Your answer is turned upside down. Uh, it has been wrongly marked. Those who have answered it as 20, uh, as um, Turned upside down is right. Badly damaged is not correct. Uh, this has been marked wrong. It is D. It is D. No guys, it is D. So there is a mistake here. Your answer is turned upside down. I, Guys, this is the first time I am conducting Mentimeter Menti quiz. So I really don't know how to fix this. But promise you the next time we have, I will know how to fix this. Or there won't be mistakes like this. It is D guys. The D answer is D. Turned upside down. Now I will give you a sentence guys. I will give you a sentence. Uh, see, the car hit, the car was hit by a truck coming from the opposite direction turned turtle. Did you understand? It is not badly dam damaged. It means when you, uh, suppose there is an accident happening, a truck hitting a car and when the truck hits the car, the car turns upside down. That is turned turtle. Saraswati, did you get it? All of you. D is the answer, guys. Uh, there has been a mistake. So, I don't know how to set it right because it's the first time even I'm conducting Menti, Menti quiz. Next time, we are going to perfect it. Not to worry. See the leader mode. There may be a little garbar in it, but it's okay. So, just let's see how it is happening. Super! So we have Maumita, Dev, Varun, Jagriti, Smita, Suchita, Tripati, Shiva, Singh, Kainat, Mahima, Chaudhary, Parikshit, Yadav, Anchal. Yes! Amazing! 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 Super! Excellent! Yes guys! Got it? Yeah! Yeah! Technical issue! Thoda garbar ho gaya! Anyway! Koi baat nahi! Uh, we are going to make it up now. Okay. Get ready for the next question. Get ready for the next question. Guys, if you are enjoying this session, please like and share immediately. Please like and share immediately. Okay. So, here comes your answers. Choose wisely. Take a minute. You have 51 seconds to go. Join in guys quickly. So 37 seconds to go guys. Super Parikshit. Super. Super Parikshit. Back up. Ha Chaitanya. A misfire. <laughs> okay we have 18 seconds to go. Hurry up. So spoke volume rolled upwards, expressed through the eyes, conveyed a great deal, showed emotion. Choose wisely guys. 3, 2, 1. Here goes your answer. Woo! Oh my god. <laughs> so we have 
between four, uh, between uh, C and D, we have tough competition. So C is the correct answer. The Ajayan, Saraswati Bhalla, amazing, amazing. Yes, it's not B, it's not B. Guys, any part of your body can speak volumes. Any part, it can be eyes, it can be your uh, face, right? So that can, even your smile can speak volumes. So convey a great deal. That's the answer, guys. C is the answer. What are the other options? Rolled upwards? No. Uh, you can roll your eyes upwards. Then express through the eyes. It is not mentioned. Then it is conveying a great deal. That's the answer. D is the answer. So any part of your face can convey, can speak volumes, isn't it? So it is not mentioned whether it is eyes or face or your smile or your mannerisms. So because of that, we will just stick to a general meaning which would be conveyed a great deal. Amazing. Yes, guys. Chalo, aage bade. Okay, I am about to show you the leaderboard. Amazing. So we we'll just wait for a minute and then we will. Woo. Amazing. So it is Varun is the fastest followed by Smita, Shiva Singh, Kainat, Momita De, DRJ, Aaron Sam, Jagriti, Blueberry, Suchita Tripathi. Amazing. Amazing. Great, great guys. Super, super performance by all of you. We have 36 pl players here and I am very excited. Super. Let me move on to the next question. Now coming up, seventh question guys. Select the odd man out. Be very, very careful. Select the odd man out. You have diamond, spade, pawn and club. Those who have not joined in, please join in quickly. The Menti app code is 501830. You have 40 seconds to go. Quickly, guys. Tara, D is not correct. C is correct. Yes, guys, 24 seconds to go. Join in, join in quickly. Woo, what is the right answer? 90, yes, pawn is the right answer and 19 of you have given me the correct answer. Amazing, C is the answer guys. Now, what is, select the odd man guys, diamond, spade and club. They are, what are they? You can find them in a pack of cards, isn't it? Pawn is the only odd man out. Hi Dolly Shah, join in, join in the quiz. We are at the seventh question. Please join in. So guys, what does pawn mean? Pawn means a stake, isn't it? Pawn means a stake. Yeah, so pawn is the odd man out. Did all of you follow any doubts? Guys, if you do not follow any words uh, and you need me to explain, I will be happy to explain. Please do let me know. Yeah, guys, here. Super, I am moving on to the leaderboard. Hi, Ankita Ja, you have joined in late, my dear. Why did you join in late? We are, we have finished the seventh question. I am about to show the leaderboard. Here goes the leaderboard. Wait, wait, wait. Let's see. Let's see the marks joining, adding up. Wow. The marks are joining up. Now, let's see the top ten. Okay, Varun. Varun is the fastest. Amazing, Varun. Keep up the good work. Smith of Kainat. Amazing. Aaron Sam. Jagriti. Jagriti slowly rising up the ladder. 
Blueberry, Shiva Singh, Mahima Chaudhary, Achal, and Momita De. You guys are the top 10 out of 35 participants. So give a tap on your shoulders, guys. Give a tap on your shoulders. Amazing work. Yeah, pa. did all of you get it? Uh, you are having, now, I, now is it okay, Ankita? If it is okay, just go to Play Store, download Mentimeter and uh, just uh, apply this code 501830 and you will be able to join in. Yes, super. Can we go on to the next question? Yes, I'm moving on to the eighth question. Okay, there is another question of select the odd man out. Load, ease, burden, encumber. Quickly guys, quickly, quickly. Uh, you have 50 seconds to go. Amazing. Page the annex, Deco. Yes, you have 30 seconds to go, guys. Take your time, think, and then answer. Dia has already come up with an answer. Dia, are you playing? Yep, Dolly Shan, uh, Rushikesh Sapkali, Shubhangi Kishore, Chandan Pandey, Chaitanya Sai, Yash Sangvi. Kishan Gupta, 3, 2, 1, here goes the answer. Super. Woo. Yes, 25 of you have got the correct answer, guys. Amazing. A big clap to all of you. Now, load, burden, encumber. They are all troublesome and they are a big burden on you, right? Is, is the odd man out and 25 of you have got it correct. So, yes, Jagriti, just hang on and see how many questions I have for you. Yes, so did, is everyone clear about it? Any doubt? Any doubt you have, guys? Encumbrance also means, you know, a big, uh, like, you know, if you have a loan on your head, that's a big encumbrance for you. It's a burden on your head, isn't it? Akshay Harak, I just explained that you know if you have a loan on your head or a debt then what happens it's a big headache for you know it's a big burden on you on your finances right so that is encumbrance did you follow guys clear guys dear j is me only okay dear no charges, Dolly. No charges at all. It is free. Please join in. Okay. I am moving on to the next. I am moving on to the leaderboard, guys. Here comes the leaderboard. Amazing. Just let's wait and see where uh, the names get shuffled. And let's see. Okay, Varun, you are leading. Amazing, Varun. Amazing job. Followed by Smita. Great. And Kainath, I'm very proud of you. Aaron, Sam, Jagriti, Blueberry, Archil, Dia, J. Oh, Dia, you're here. Abhi and Gaurav Patel. So, Patel, all of you are among the ten, top 10 guys out of 35 participants. Amazing, amazing. So all of you, if you are enjoying, please quickly like, share and hit the um, uh, like button guys. Please hit the like button quickly, quickly. Yes, please move. Let's move on to the next question coming up next. Again, we have the select the odd man out. Here comes your choices. 52 seconds to go. 
maladroit, clumsy, deft, and unwieldy. Yes, guys, 38 seconds. We have, come on guys, 23 seconds to go. So I have some answers coming in. 3, 2, 1. Here goes your answers guys. So you, depth is the answer, excellent. So 17 of you got it correct out of 35. Guys, what does, yeah, I am just explaining the meanings, guys. So maladroit means lack of skill. A person who is not skilled is maladroit. Adroit means skillful. Maladroit means a lack of skill. Clumsy, you know what is the meaning of clumsy, isn't it? Awkward. Whereas deft is skillful. Deft means skillful. Unwieldy also means unmanageable. So the odd man out is deft. Deft is skillful, guys. Amazing, amazing, amazing. All of you are doing great. Let's move on. Can we see the leaderboard, guys? Are you ready for the leaderboard? Tricky one. Ananda, Ananda, you found it tricky? Excellent. I am moving on to the next one. Super. We are having fun, aren't we? Please hit the like button quickly. Dexterous is skillful, isn't it? Okay, just let's check the leaderboard now. Uh, Varun, you are leading. Yes, with 6492 points. Then Aaron Sam, Jagriti, Smita, Kainan, Blueberry, Dia J, Shukri, Shuk, sorry, Shrutika, and Gaurav Patel, and AK. AK is a new joining here. So you are the top 10 among the 35 participants we have. Uh, why didn't the other six join in? You have 41 here. Guys, unwilled, unwieldy uh, means unmanageable, unmanageable, unskillful. They all, they all fall in the same category, ma'am. Oh, you are facing network issue, Ankita. Doesn't matter. So, guys, did you make a note of your uh, position on the leaderboard? Great, great. I am moving on to the next one. Quickly guys, the next one will be a little tricky. Be careful. Okay. Here comes your next question. Analogies guys, be very careful. This is talking about relationships. Okay, so this is relationships, money is to mercenary, fame is to soldier, love is to mother, pass is to student, gold is to midas. Tell me the answer. Be careful, you have 44 seconds to go. Please be careful, you have 23 seconds to go. Amazing. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Here goes your time, here is your result. What is the answer? Gold is to Midas and 11 of you have got it correct. Guys, just let me explain this. The answer is D, guys, D. Uh, so, 
What does this analogy mean? Money is to mercenary. Mercenary is a person who is very money oriented. He will be looking at ways and means to earn money. Okay, fame is to soldier, doesn't fit the context. Love is to mother, doesn't fit the context. Pass is to student, doesn't uh, fit the context. Midas was a person who, who was um, obsessed with gold. So that's the uh, reason we have Midas touch, isn't it? So he was crazy after gold. So gold is to Midas is the right answer. Did all of you follow guys? D is your answer. Yeah, one who is very money oriented. He is mercenary. Did all of you follow guys? Any doubts about this? Be careful. Of, I have two, three analogies coming up now. So I want you to be overtly careful. Yes, guys. Yeah. I am moving on to the leaderboard, guys. Here comes your leaderboard. Amazing. Let's see who is leading. Wow. Wow, Jagrati. Amazing. Amazing, Jagrati. You have reached the second position. So, Varun is still leading with 6492 points, followed by 6339. Jagrati. Then Aaron Sam, Smitha, Kaina, Blueberry, Dia J, Shrutika, Shiva Singh, Gaurav Patel. Now you guys are the top 10 among 38 students. Mercenary means a person who runs after money. Very money oriented. He is a mercenary. Yes guys, did all of you follow? Amazing, I move on. I'm moving on to the next question. Just be a little careful for the analogies, guys. Cadaver is to animal. So you have corpse is to man, stick is to timber, death is to life, word is to sentence. Please pick your answer wisely. Understand the relationship and then choose your answer. So you have 39 seconds to go. Yes, guys, 24 seconds to go. Super, super. Two, one. Here goes your answer, guys. It is 17 of you have answered correctly. There are 36 playing now. So what does cadaver mean? Cadaver means the remains, the dead remains. Okay. So it says the remains of an animal. That goes corpse is the remains of a man, isn't it? So that is how the connection stick and timber, death and life, word and sentence doesn't qualify. It doesn't show the same relationship. Guys, basically, those who are not able to, uh, I finally, before excellent, you've joined in. I'm so happy. Okay. Uh, so guys, uh, uh, the relationship is, you have to understand the relationship which is given um, at the uh, head, okay? Cadaver is to animal. You have to find the same relationship in the answers. That's how you're going to get a correct answer. Yes, obviously, before I am going to, uh, if you are enjoying this, we are going to have uh, maybe every Saturday, can we have it? If you... If all of you people say, feel the same, I can have it every Saturday. Get you with interesting questions. Amazing. I'm moving on to the next one, guys. Now, this come, here comes your leaderboard. Okay, okay. 
let's see fine so via is rising up the ladder varun you are still leading and jagriti oh my god what a leap i am so proud of you jagriti followed by aaron sam via j smita kainat blueberry parikshit amazing amazing try to climb up the ladder archal and jubeda amazing jubeda welcome welcome and archal was the fastest here great 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 you are enjoying a lot okay then you hit the like button quickly quickly only then i will get you all these quizzes that's my benefit to know guys okay chalo i'll move on to the next question okay find the synonym of dexterous now adept intelligent devoted sincere please find the synonym not the antonym great going guys please you have 39 seconds to go So guys we have 12 seconds left hurry up and answer quickly quickly 3 2 1 here goes your answer woo so 16 of you out of 36 students 16 has got it correct and the meaning i guys are uh, actually um bia was asking me the antonym for dexterous now dexterous means skillful right so skillful a synonym for skillful is adept and a person who is not skilled who is dumb who is a dud he is uh, that would be the antonym for dexterous right so adept is the right answer i think intelligent devoted and sincere all of you know the meaning isn't it amazing i will just show you the leaderboard now who close call let's see let's see who is climbing up the ladder okay okay excellent so varun is still leading following at close heels is jagriti followed by aaron sam dia j kainat parikshit yadav momita de anjal smita shiva singh amazing 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 great going guys super i am enjoying as much as you guys are you know so out of 36 students i have these are the top 10 amazing fine i am going on to the next question Sambit why are you in so much of a hurry now synonym of acrid find out the synonym of acrid mild pungent severe slight so you have 50 seconds to go You have thirty-five seconds. Amazing, guys! Amazing. So twenty seconds. So the answers are coming in. Uh, Rohit Sabu, Momita De, Suchita Tripathi. They have started answering already. Let's see. Three, two, one. Here goes your answer. Coming up, guys. You, twenty-three out of thirty-six students have answered correctly. Amazing. So, guys, uh, if you remember, if you remember uh, the synonym for acrid, guys, it is from the root word ac or acr, which means sharp or sour, isn't it? 
Jagriti would be knowing it because I told her specifically to learn the root words. So acrid means something which has a sharp taste or a sour taste. So the answer is pungent. Amazing. This is correct. And I will move on to the leaderboard. See the leaderboard. Okay. Shuffling up. Shuffling up. Let's see. I see a lot of points adding. So... Woo! So, people are rising up the ladder. Uh, Varun is still at leading. 9 to 5, 1 points. Amazing. Aaron Sam followed by Jagriti. Kainath is rising up the ladder. Parikshit is rising up the ladder. Dia, come on, push it, put in a little more effort. Last two, three questions, guys. Blueberry, Gaurav Patel, Suchita Tripathi. Amazing, amazing, amazing. I'm moving on to the next one. Yes, guys. So, let's see now. Antonym of soporific. Antonym of soporific. Yes. Harsh. Okay. Quickly, guys. So, you have 49 seconds. Soporific. Inciting. Inducing. Invigorating. And consoling. You have to find the antonym, not the synonym, guys. Remember, no synonym. This is an antonym. Choose your answer wisely. Yes, you have 20 seconds left. So, I am getting some answers. I am getting some answers. Kunal Deep Santam Roy. Samant Roy, sorry. Samant Roy. Okay, two, one. Here goes your answer, guys. Everyone has voted. Super. So, your answer is invigorating. Invigorating. Guys, so for a fake. Uh, just to give you an explanation for this, it comes from the root word SOP or SOMN. Now that means to sleep, right? So, uh, soporific means drug induced sleep, right? So, the opposite would be energetic, right? So, invigorating means full of energy. I will just give you. Oh, you didn't. Uh, why didn't you read, Kainath? You have to be more alert, right? So guys, I'll just give you a quick meaning of all these words. So inciting means stimulating. That is option A. Inciting means stimulating. Inducing means to influence, to convince. Okay? And consoling, you know the meaning is comforting, right? Did all of you understand, guys? I'm moving on to the leaderboard. Here comes the leaderboard, a quick shuffle of the leaderboard. Let's see where each one is heading to. Okay, so Varun is, excellent job Varun. So Varun is still leading, followed by Aaron Sam. Aaron Sam had come off to the fourth or fifth position. He is bouncing back. And then we have Jagrati, then Kainath, Parikshit, Shiva Singh. Harika, uh, Diya J, Momita Day, and Shrutika. Amazing. So, out of 37 students, these are the top 10 guys. Amazing. I am moving on to the next question. So, the 15th one, guys, synonym of deadlock. Now, Please look at the options carefully. This is the last question of the day. Please look at the questions carefully, guys. Please be very, very careful. Grudge, expiry, endorsement, stalemate. You are looking for the synonym, not the antonym. It's the synonym. Samvet Patil, hi. I saw your, uh, you know, you were just telling me, ma'am, ma faster, faster, faster. But then we have to give chance for the others to read the question, right? So, deadlock is your question. Now, you have to find a synonym for it. Please be careful. Okay, guys. Quickly. 
Okay, I have two. One. Here goes your answer, guys. We are waiting. 15 of you out of 30 students have got it correct. Deadlock means stalemate. That is, you are at a deadlock, a stalemate. Then grudge. You know the meaning of grudge, right, guys? What is the meaning of grudge? When you have some uh, feeling of um, hostility or some feel, some negative feeling about someone, right? That is your grudge or some hard feelings, right? Then expiry, of course, you know. And endorsement means promotion, isn't it? So that is excellent. So let's look at the final scoreboard. Shall we look at the final scoreboard, guys? Are you ready? Yes, guys, some suspense I'm building up. Can we see the, can we see the final, final, final leaderboard? Yes, guys, are you ready? Let's see who, who has won this quiz. Are you ready, guys? Okay, here comes your leaderboard. The final leaderboard. Okay, just let's see where everyone is. And, and. Woo! Got a, a Varun, a big clap to you. Kudos to you. It is, you win with 9,251 points. Followed by Aaron Sam, 9188 points. And Jagriti, 8104. I am so proud of Jagriti. Now, guys, I have a reason to praise her because, you know, she, just two months back, she, came, she was telling me, ma'am, I don't know. I am not uh, too aware of the synonyms and antonyms. And I told her, please go through my videos of root words. She did it diligently and see the result today. I'm very proud of you, Jagriti. Excellent work. I'm very, very proud of you. Amazing, amazing. Guys, I had a wonderful time with you. I hope you enjoyed the session. If you have enjoyed the session, please hit the like button and share it. And also subscribe to hashtag cat live daily, guys. Please subscribe to hashtag cat live daily and let me remind you cat is approaching fast those who are not very sure of cracking it by themselves we are here to help you English you need extra help please take the subscription and join the course we are going to take a one-on-one -on -one session you will get personalized attention and you will have live doubt clearing sessions too you can choose your educator and attend as many sessions as possible, guys. Please take my word seriously. You guys were amazing. We had an excellent time together. Hope to see you soon with another lovely quiz like this. And take care. Have a very good evening. Bye-bye. See you. Take care, guys. Excellent. Please do not forget to like and share the video, please.